This is Darius from therabbitpad.com, and in this video, I'm going to show you a tool that exists in Microsoft PowerPoint that will allow you to easily match the background of a slide with a color within the slide. Please make sure that you hit that subscribe button below and also click that notification bell so that you can receive updates when I publish videos in the future. When I first discovered this tool in PowerPoint, I was dumbfounded because I could not believe I went so long without knowing how to match the background of my slide with a color inside of a photo. And I would spend so much time trying to manually match the format of the background by just experimenting with different colors like this or trying another shade darker or even trying to go to the more colors tool and playing around with different shades. But that's not something you have to do in PowerPoint. There is this tool inside PowerPoint called the eyedropper tool that will allow you to select a pixel or a part of your photo and match your background to that color. In this video, we'll show you how to do that. What you do is you go to the design tab in PowerPoint and then you select solid fill and then you select which color you would like to use. I am using PowerPoint for Mac, but you can do the same thing in Windows. So click the bucket next to color and then go down to more colors. And there you will see this little dropper thing. And I'm just going to move this window out of the way. I click the dropper which allows me to select any pixel in that picture or basically I can select any color on the screen but let's say I want to make the background of my slide the same color as the sky I just click that and it has selected the color and then I click OK and now the background of the slide is the same color as the area of the sky within the picture I selected Let's try this with the drawing. So again, you go to the paint bucket and then you select more colors. And I believe in Windows, the eyedropper tool will be visible from here. But on the Mac, you select more colors. I'm moving this out of the way again. And then I select the dropper. And let's say I want to make the color of the background this shade of orange. I select that and then I click OK. And now the background of this slide matches the orange that was in the carrot. If you found this video helpful, please click that like button and subscribe to this channel so that you can receive notifications when I publish videos in the future. Also, please be sure to visit my website at therabbitpad.com.